So did you need any money? Like you like, spend money, you spend money on the um the tools of the game. Okay. The laptop. Okay. But that was the third time. The mic, the shit that, to record yourself. You know what I'm talking about? Promotional tools. You know what I mean? Like back in the days, it was CDs. It was you know okay. what I mean? Flyers. It was um uh, that kind of money. I don't consider that spending money. Like that's you you putting that back into yourself. So that's that's coming back. If I'm, if I'm spending three fifty for a thousand CDs. And I'm selling a CD. I don't consider that spending money because I can go flip that. I actually just made myself more money by investing into myself. Invest. The act of putting money, effort, time, etc. into something to make a profit or to get an advantage. Often, the act of making an investment is associated with buying stock, real estate property, and more recently cryptocurrency in order to flip some cash and bring in more money. But the best place to invest is not going to be found on Wall Street or in a crypto wallet. The best place to invest is in yourself. Especially if you're a creator who would like to eventually make a living off of your creative projects. A great example of a creative whose self-investment has paid off for them is Larry June. Larry June is an independent artist from the Bay Area who's been making music since 2006, gradually building his catalog and fan base as the years go on. In March of this year, he released his most high-profile project to date, The Great Escape, a collab album with legendary hip-hop producer the Alchemist. Larry has shown to have a great understanding of what it truly means to invest in yourself and is always open to sharing some of his secrets to his success. I, I like to invest into myself a lot. I feel like when you're coming up, investing into yourself is worth more than real estate. Mm. That's my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. you can create something and make money forever for your family. And a house, you know, like, that's cool. Don't get me wrong. Like, mm -hmm. But when you when you creating a legacy and 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 and, uh, and um investing into yourself and then what you're trying to do, is you know you can pass it down. Like I said, I can give my brother the game. He can make money forever too. I can mm -hmm. just woo woo woo. Mm -hmm. But the game being so digital now, when you say that, it's like what get a laptop and a mic and, and the right equipment, right? I mean that's how you started. You get that, but you also after you get to a certain point. So I didn't spend a lot of money on myself at first coming up in the game. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, of course. You get the you get the attention to people, and then from there you gotta show okay now what. Mm. We know you, bro. Like you did hella tapes and shit. Now what you can do? So all right, we go and we go invest some money into the craft. We go spend more money on video. We go pay for the marketing. We go do other things. But like coming up, get a laptop, microphone. It's all about the internet. So easy. Start off with a laptop if you're an independent <laughs> artist, a, a microphone, yeah. and um, utilize the internet because the internet, the internet is powerful, man. But do it in a cool way. It's yeah, all man. about what can you bring different to the game. I don't eat oranges every day. <laughs> I'm being hundred percent honest with you. Uh, it's, it's, it's all marketing. You gotta mm. know how to. You gotta do something different. That's go. That's go capture the people mm. and, and and separate you from others mm -hmm. because there's so many people doing this music shit. So when you come in the game, you gotta like, okay, you rap, cool. Yeah. You mm -hmm. a great rapper, like, cool. What else you got for right. us? Like, what else yeah. can you? You know what I mean? Yeah. So that's my big thing. Get the equipment to do it yourself. Save a little money and, and bring something different to the game. Yeah. yeah. And it's, it's that simple. Everybody in competition, but all you gotta do is create. Mm, yeah. Create some shit. Even even when I was going through my little shit and I was trapping and fucking around, I recorded tapes and I had always had my portable studio with me. <laughs> and, I, and I always knew like, this is my backup plan and this and my backup plan gonna eventually be my my main source of income. Mm. And I, 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 everybody around me believed it too. Mm. Cause, I was, Cause I believed it so much. With a little bit of passion and putting time into your craft, everything can change. Mm. And I think one year, everything can change. Mm. You stay on your grind every day for a year, mm -hmm. you, know, you can have anything you want. Right. Anything. So do you <laughs> think most people like that dedication? Like they, they, have, they have the dream of wanting to do it, but they don't realize all the work and all the sacrifice it takes? It's just consistency. Mm -hmm. 
you gotta be you gotta really put that it don't even you don't gotta even work as hard as people think you gotta just be you gotta just put that work in you gotta do something it can't be no days when you sleep all day. Mm. It can't be no days. Yeah. You can't let no. You can't let nobody. If you a female, you can't let a dude stress you out. You can't have a female stressing you out. You gotta understand that. You gotta invest that time into your life. Yeah. And right now, it don't really matter. The future is what really matters. You mm. get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, none of this shit go. Man, you can be in a bucket, no gas. You stressing out. Can't think. You can't think about the painful part of it. You gotta keep rocking. And putting that work in and everything will change for you. You said believe in the beauty of your dreams. You got to believe in the beauty of your dreams. Believe in the beauty of your dreams. A monetary investment in yourself is basically the physical representation of your belief in yourself. Making a financial commitment to your dreams can be risky and a little frightening. I know this from personal experience. This is the first video on the channel in a little over four months. That is all because of my reluctance to invest in a new computer when I first had the chance to a few months ago. If I had taken the risk and made the investment earlier, I would not have been left stranded when my older laptop could not work anymore. I finally decided it was now or never and took the risk and in investing into a brand new computer to continue to hit the goals for this channel. I would like to say a quick thank you to anyone who stuck around through this hiatus. And a bigger thank you to anyone who supported the channel by buying merch from ForTheFamily.co. We are working on a drop that honors two people whose mindsets helped shape the identity of this channel. The drop will be available by this summer in the middle of June. If you support what we're doing here at Friends and Family, this is the best way for you to make an investment into us, while also receiving quality merch and the ability to physically represent the community that we're building here. If you don't want merch, you can always leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. It's free. An investment in yourself does not always have to be something of monetary value. Sometimes the greatest currency to invest in yourself is time. I also see like you don't mind sharing game. Like I think I saw something yeah. with you and Wallow when you was like kind of encouraging like artists out here that are doing their thing. It's like, you know, let's say you have to work a real job. You still got to take that time to like pursue your dream, like, like yeah. take advantage. Like you said, I think you said at least thirty minutes of your day. Yeah, that's that's the that's the bare yeah. minimum. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like, you want to put time into your if you really want to do it, if you're passionate mm -hmm. about it, you want to put time into your craft and and what you what you're doing, and you got to do it every day. Right. Yeah. Every day, but you got to also build it up too. You got to that thirty minutes got to turn into an hour. I'm, 30 minutes is the bare minimum. That's right. what I'm saying, yeah. That's the, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. For the person that has to have yeah. a job, and they, they yeah, secretly want to be in music, yeah, but somebody, how do you go about it? Some people might yeah. have like three kids and working two jobs, so they don't have that time. Yeah. So like, that's why I say if you're passionate about it, you got to put some time into mm. it. If not, you're going to be sitting there just saying what you should have did later. You right. know what I mean? And yeah. Invest your time in you. If you have a job, you wake up every day, and invest your time into your employer in exchange for a paycheck. If you are a student, you invest your time into studying, homework, and test taking in exchange for good grades, a diploma, and or a degree. So you owe it to yourself to invest time into you and your dreams. The exchange that you receive back will be exponential. It is easy to overlook your own personal needs and goals, but it is not selfish to set time away for yourself or to set money away for yourself. You don't even need to start with a lot of money or a lot of time. If you find it hard to give yourself money or time to invest into your dreams, utilize the 10% law. This law was brought to my attention from the book, The Richest Man in Babylon by George S. Klassen. In the novel, the character of Arkad, who was the richest man in Babylon, decided early on in his life that no matter how little or how much he earned, he was entitled to keep at least a portion of whatever he made. He decided a good portion to keep was 10%. This means that no matter what type of income you receive, whether it's from working or from a gift, always put away 10%. If you get $100, save $10. If you get $1,000, save $100. No money is truly yours until you deliberately put it aside for yourself. The same law can be set for time, but with a little bit more flexibility. There are 24 hours in a day, so 10% of a day it's two and a half hours. A lot of people may not have two and a half hours to themselves, depending on what responsibilities they have in their day. But the principle is still the same. No time is truly your time 
until you deliberately put time aside for yourself. It is important to recognize that you need to be the number one believer in you. Investing in yourself is the truest form of self-love and self-belief. Remember, self-investment is key to understanding your vision. Thank you to anyone who sent us positive messages and comments while we were away and will never abandon this community. Even though we did not post on YouTube in over four months, we still try to regularly post on our Instagram. So if you want to stay up to date with us or see some of the shorter form content that we put out during our time off, check us out at Stop Hating, Make Friends. If you would like to support the channel, the best way to do that is to head over to ForTheFamily.co. We have a new drop coming to the site in mid-June and we hope you all enjoy it. We've been putting a lot of work into it and are ready to give you a cool way to represent friends and family while out in the world. If you don't want any merch, there's always free ways to support us, like leaving a like on the video and subscribing to the channel. We are also getting back to updating our Break From 808's playlist on Spotify and Apple Music. The links for everything are in the description below, including the link to the full free audiobook of The Richest Man in Babylon if you want to check that out in your free time. Thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great day. Thank you.